Cybernetics Made Easy. Th Part 1, The Basic Control Loop by Robert Johansson. The term cybernetics comes from the Greek word kyberneo, which means to steer, to guide, or to govern. In plain English, it is the theory of control. We are all familiar with the basic control process. You do something, you act, you see how it turns out, you make sense of it, you compare the results to what you wanted, evaluating. You choose another action to bring it closer to your goal, you choose. Then you do something else, you act. The cybernetic control loop consists of these four basic processes. You act, sense, evaluate, and choose. These four basic processes form a loop. Any control process consists of going around this basic control loop. Each of the individual processes around the control loop is an information process. An information process consists of translating one form of information into another form of information. We can use a box as a symbol of the translation process and the arrow as a symbol of the information. Thus, information in one form is translated into information in another form. Thus, acting as an information process consists of our action being translated by the environment into changes or results. Sensing is an information process that consists of the changes being translated by our models into perceptions. Evaluating consists of those perceptions being translated by our values into needs. Choosing consists of our needs being translated by our options into action. Thus the four translation processes are environment, models, values, and options. The translation processes are information. They are commands about how to process information. In other words, programs. The translation processes constitute the program that controls the control process. This is a general model of control. It applies to all control processes. To analyze any control system or decision-making system, there are four questions. What part of the environment is the system trying to control? What is the model they are using to understand the environment? What values are they attempting to maintain? And what are the options available to them?